All right, just left Stanwood. Car is fully packed. And we're going to the outlet mall to hopefully get me more than just five pairs of shorts. So I don't have to do laundry every five days. Fortunately, he has two weeks of underwear and two weeks of socks. He can always wear his shorts more than one day. But this mom, not happy. Here we go. My dad's not gonna be here to vlog when I go on drives later, so if I'm gonna vlog, I need to practice using my phone all while driving. Uh, we got gas, visited my dad's work. I got three pairs of shorts. One of them's actually blue and orange, which is different. The other ones are black with like a white underneath. I can show you guys later. I don't know you guys are. That's what most people say when they're talking to their camera. But, yes, now to listen to four hours of Aragon, The Inherited Cycle 2, Eldest. A really great book. All right, see ya. All right, we're at a rest stop just past Olympia. The traffic was pretty bad, lots of stop and go. I got really tired when my dad was at, in a meeting and I couldn't listen to my audiobook, but as soon as that was over, it was all good. He's in the restroom now, and I'll get back to you when we're driving. All right, at the hotel, just swam and played with uh, all the soccer, the zealous soccer girlfriends, and they chased me all over the hotel and we got in trouble, but it was still a lot of fun. And yeah, it's the last day before I move into George Fox. So David doesn't have his COVID test though, uh, result in. So we're praying that uh, that comes in in time. Yeah, good night. Oh, look at all of these girls. Alright, now I'm pacing back and forth because I want to get to the college so we can sign in earlier rather than later so there's not a whole bunch of people there. But we haven't left yet. No, it's fine. <coughs> Alright, so we're unpacking here. I completely forgot about doing the check in and stuff, but table's coming along. Um, it's kind of weird drilling when you're not supposed to be doing anything to the walls and if people hear drilling, they might be freaking out, but no one's come in yet. I'm gonna go get my monitor from my car and I'll be back. What are you in line for food right now? Hey bud, I'll just take one Trying to herd David along. David. So we can go come on, bud. to our theme. Oh, he's yeah. got the schedule. Do you have a schedule in your thing? Okay. Should we take a picture? First one. Both of you guys. Here, go stand up. I'd want to do it, but I'm not sure. <laughs> Gonna go eat. Oh, yeah. Then they have to go to another game or something. Correct. Got a blanket. Hello. Uh, it is the morning after my first night here. I still not sure if I'm going to be vlogging or taking videos of uh, my weeks here at George Fox because I seem to video this I video when the stuff that is not um, interesting and the stuff I would want to video I'm either too embarrassed to or I can't take my phone out uh, but I'll recap what happened yesterday or last night uh, let's see 
So, checked in. We checked in, got our luggage. People said, yay, Zay. It was kind of weird at first because it was like, uh, I don't know, I'm not used to it. People said, yay, and Zay, Zay did here, but it was kind of fun. Moved in all well. This table right here. I actually haven't showed you the room yet, so I'll take a video of that later. But, set everything up, then, what did we do? We... Uh, went to the fair Fairgrounds over there and they had a whole bunch of booths up and we met uh, some engineering students and professors That was pretty interesting Then we went Then I picked up my books. I ordered from the library the book. I ordered from Amazon and I don't remember what the third thing was. I need to do this the night of. Um, and then we had two at the auditorium, or in front of the football stadium. The stadium, I mean. We had uh, one chapel service and one like welcome students with parents. Uh, we had a really long line for dinner outside, potluck with everyone. Uh, sat with. Uh, not my floor, but the first floor, which has Stuart, Timmy, which is like one of my new best friends, plays board games. I could talk to you about him later. And uh, yeah, so we were eating, done eating, we talked funny stuff. Then we were like, oh, uh, what? Uh, We should go play spike ball. And we're like, no way, can we actually? And then we went to do our Edwards, played spike ball for an hour and a half. That was a lot of fun, got sweaty. Uh, took a little rinse of the hair, and then went to the other chapel service. And my mom was talking to me, right, calling me right now, so I probably shouldn't hang up. I will finish this when I get back. All right, where were we? I think I, 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 well, uh, okay, so, after, after we went to the last chapel service, we came to the dorm room and met with our floor. I've been previously hanging out with the first floor, so I actually didn't know many people on the third floor, but then we went outside, uh, got in a group, played Two Truths and a Lie. Here's David coming in. No, you're good, you're good, you're good. So we played two truths and a lie. Uh, my truths and a lie were uh, I fell off a zip line and broke my tailbone by falling on pavement. That was a lie. Uh, I've thrown a piano off a balcony and I didn't wear jeans until sophomore year. And then after the we did last, that. The third one was a lie. Or, no, the fir third one was alive, but the first one, uh, the first one I told you was that. And we also did handshakes, where I did a handshake with this guy named Tristan. And I'm gonna see if I can actually remember do it in the air. So shake, shake, spin around, and then go around like this. And then you do the pretzel. And then up, down, punch, jellyfish. Then right leg, left leg, spin around. Right leg, and then we did the pretzel swing dance move, and then that was the end. And we got voted the best handshake. And then we came inside, played uh, the mind board game with David, and uh, the, is it the, are they right across from us? Uh, Andrew. Yeah. Yeah. And what's what's the other guy's name? Jared. Jared. Well, the people right across from us is Andrew and Tristan, though. So they're not dorming together? That's a different Andrew. So it's not right across from us. They're like over there. Somewhere. That's 315. I think that's like Okay, so there may be there a room across from us. Came in, played the mind for a bit. Timothy came in. He's a, a board game fanatic. He watched that game, but hopefully play more games with him. And then uh, 
was sweaty from spike ball still, so took a shower, got situated with that, got my towel out of my car, came back in, and then fell asleep. Kind of. Didn't fall asleep very well. Rolled and turned. And then it was this morning, took a shower, went and ate breakfast. It was a continental breakfast. Uh, not, not very healthy. Not gonna eat granola from now on in the mornings. So it'll also make like it a lot easier. Donut. Yeah, like donuts. Some cheesy burrito like the, stuff. Yeah, it was kind of good, kind of not good. There was this uh, old-fashioned blueberry donut that was good though. And then uh, got back here, did the previous video that just got. Yeah, the previous video we just that I got cut off with because my mom called me, so we were here. Got this, uh, uh, dropped off the uh, washcloth because we forgot my towels and stuff at home, and candy. Then just went to a service that talked uh, about with our professors and what student life was going to be like and stuff. And now we're here going to lunch. Yes! All right, we're heading to our last oh. lunch. <laughs> yes, to our last lunch uh, with our families for a while. We're going over the bridge right now. They think, they think we're leaving, but we're actually staying forever. We've got the room next to you guys. <laughs> yep, got a little creek over the bridge. Yeah. I thought I'd give a brief tour of the room while I had time. I'll go to the door. That's what it looks like on the outside. The bathroom's down there. It's so quiet. That's the third, third floor entrance. Open the door, walk in. We have our rug that we brought from my house. Open the door, turn on the lights. And starting back here on my side, Definitely not COVID. Um, fridge, we have our chocolate milk, normal milk, cheese, water, normal stuff. Freezer, gonna get some bagel dogs or something in there. Couple bananas, microwave, box storage, put stuff up there. Then junk food and dishes and toiletries and stuff. Then Nice little picture frame I put there. Board games. My third of the board games I brought. And here's just like a little bit of toiletry stuff I need to get to now. Here's my where I keep my clothes. There is my bed. My picture frame is on the wall there. My bed. Storage underneath there. Then here's the desk we built. Over there it's printer music stuff. Haven't really figured out what I'm putting up there yet. Then have my uh, computer stand next to my monitor. Have my sliding my keyboard up under there. Storage underneath there. This is David's setup. My light, study light. And this is a standing desk, so if we wanted to, we can raise it. This is only halfway for now, but raised up so we could stand. Uh, and this is David's side. Bed, spike ball net. This is where we're keep hanging up our clothes. And that's David's choice of food, or what his mom brought. Mirrors, and yeah, that's pretty much it. It's really, felt really small when we first got in, but now it's pretty nice. I was like, well, I don't know if your dad left for a reason. I was like, well, I don't know if dad. Dad just wants everybody to behave. I don't know if a hug is so But yeah, she was like, you know, everything. She can't change anybody. Yeah. But the funny thing is, she's like, on her her song, she's like, but I don't understand why when they leave, everybody cries. Why would you cry? It's just soccer. She's like, it's so weird. I look around, everybody's crying, and I feel like I have to make myself cry. <laughs> I'm like, oh, what up?
All right. Vlogging time. Our last vlogging with my parents. And he's so happy. Parents going. Parents not happy. Time to go find a spot. Dad is happy. I or they'll Dad tell me, ready. tell me something nice. Oh. <laughs> I just tripped. Okay, I'll stop for now. This is the tree where I'm going to give the talk. And my room's up there. We finished having our last talk. And now I'm walking them to their car. Good lighting with my broken phone. Maybe down here. Perfect. Okay, so today we finished our. We had like a really fun, like blow up party. It was pretty fun. Uh, they had like jousting, obstacle course, which we made into a big relay race, which was a lot of fun. I was well. It's cool. Is we had our dorm three group with other people. I was actually kind of like the leader and led decided what people to do, organized groups, made rather than just a 1v1 like race obstacle course, make it a relay race, uh, change up some rules on this like wrecking ball, trying to throw the ball at people to make it launch them off. Uh, yeah, it was a lot of fun. Uh, tonight, I'm gonna have to, I'm holding myself accountable that even if I stayed out late tonight, I'm gonna finish this sexual conduct abuse uh, assault whatever course uh, so I don't have to worry about doing it during the week when I will have actual homework to do uh, made uh, some pretty good friends uh, branching out uh, it's fun being confident in myself uh, able to tease people and joke around with them and A lot of fun. Uh, I just got a shower because it's really cold and I'm trying to see if there's anything else that happened today. Nope, hopefully I'll sleep better tonight than I did last night. Spent you know, from 8:30 to 10:30 studying. I mean, taking the sexual education assault course on abuse and stuff. Kind of skipped through it. About to take the quiz on it, and then we t I took a break and went with the, a bunch of guys and played Super Fight, a fun little competition board game in the lobby. And I'll be going to bed after this. And tomorrow we'll be going to church and kind of relaxing, not doing much eating my first bowl of breakfast at George Fox. David's eating his breakfast instead of going to a continental one. A lot healthier. Uh, we'll be going to church with some people, hopefully. Uh, I think Foursquare later today. And then we really don't have anything we have to do until worship at like seven or eight. But there's a big like breakfast of arrow tag and stuff, which will be fun talk to you guys about that later. Currently on our way to Four Square Church. All right, now just got back from uh, first church service at Red Hill. It was pretty good. It was a lot like previous uh, Four Square. Um, yeah, I liked it. Not as much like scripture, like analysis. 
uh, as I'm used to. But it was, it was still good. I think that's where I'll probably go if the majority of my friends are going there. But I might look around other places. Uh, so now we have, like, it's right now, let's see, uh, 1042, around uh, at 1230 is when the rec fest begins, where it's more outdoor stuff. So I think what I'm going to do, actually, is start composing this welcome welcome weekend video uh, for you guys uh, so I don't have to do it late tonight and then uh, whatever other videos I make later today I'll just add on at the end now editing the video there are people playing Stuart and David and then Josh and not Josh what were the two guys names again Caleb his name's Caleb I'm really bad at names, but they're playing ping pong over there. But now everyone's left us. Volleyball's in like a half an hour. From the wreck fest and uh, played there from 12:30 to now 4 to 15, and I'm exhausted. <sighs> All right, I'm back from the wreck fest volleyball uh, arrow tag, and well, that's all I did for the whole time. Lots of fun. I've cut myself a lot. I ran into this volleyball post and like cut myself there and on my shoulder. I'm not sure if I can easily show it. Yep, but I'm all beat up. This bad rug burn on my chin from going down a slide face first yesterday. But now I'm really hungry. I don't know where anyone else is at. I stayed maybe an hour and a half longer. They might be doing their own thing. I'll be texting them after this, but I think while I wait for dinner, I think I think an apple sounds good. I'll be I'll cut up my first apple. Ooh, and there's cheese. Since here in college, I'll get back to you on how that goes. Apples are good. Okay, so we just came from the Hadlock Center, which had uh, arrow tag, which we did a lot for four times in a row without ever losing. Um, ice hockey, dodgeball, which I hated. Uh, but at the beginning of this, I put my phone in the locker. It's a combo locker with uh, four numbers that you open it, put your stuff in, close it, uh, set the combo to the number you want, and then lock it. Well, oh, what I, so, the, uh, at lunch today, I put it in this 
middle locker number 59. Got everything out, all good. Tonight, I walked with a friend of mine that I'm still horrible with names. And not me, by the way. Not David. I remember his name, Little Davy. Um, and he was right next to me, and I put it in what I thought was 30, uh, 59, middle locker, uh, one to the left of the far right. And I come back to that, and I open it, and there's a sucker. I freak out. Well, not really. I try not to freak out because I'm like, there's no way it got stolen. But then. I checked the combo and all the other locks. Uh, either they're not opening or they open and nothing's in there. So I let uh, the people watching over it know and they said they can't look into other lockers until after 11. So I distracted myself, did other stuff, and now David here David me. had the uh, brilliant idea of because we yes we tried calling it but it was on silent where how I always keep my phone um, but he uh, was able to go on Google and to find my device and it would call without um, it would call and ring even if I had it on silent and ran there heard it and when I thought I put it in the middle middle one I actually put it to the top left of where I thought I did and that one I put in the code and it, the reason why I thought it didn't work is I put in my code previously and tried to pull it out and didn't work but when I really yanked at it then it finally opened and now it's a big relief because now I can have my first day with a phone be able to get into my uh, room and thank you Jesus all right here we go. Uh, this is going to be the last vlog for the this welcome weekend before it's tomorrow morning. Uh, I'm trying to think if there's anything that I didn't record while my phone was stolen. Still, I'm gonna. I'm not gonna need this video to remember that. That was very. Yeah, I do not like that. But um. Oh, I signed, we signed up for clubs. I said uh, to I signed up for clubs uh, so they could send me emails. I'm not sure if I want to participate in all of them. There's also intramural. I'll get back to clubs, but and there's uh, intramural volleyball, tennis, spike ball, and one other sport that I always just like to say I remember the last sport, but. Um, somewhat self-conscious about the recording and people hearing. Um, but for clubs, I signed up for, uh, there's this hiking club that had a whole bunch of stuff I wasn't interested in, but they said possibly surfing in the future, and that's exciting, so I signed up for that. Um, uh, d and seemed kind of like a little weird of a group, not too excited about maybe joining that. Uh, still email list, maybe I could sit in. I'm not sure. Uh, board game group also. Uh, board game night. I, I think that would be pretty interesting. And fencing, I signed up for that. Somewhat interesting. And then swing dancing weekly. That That is going to be a lot of fun. And it's like it's an Eastern style mostly. So it's new, and that's going to be fun. Learn new stuff. And, add on to what I already know and yeah I'm going to be going to bed uh, I already went through today and found out where the majority of my classes are my first class tomorrow is at 10 a.m. David's is at 8 I think I'm going to let him set his alarm and wake up when he does uh, maybe get a jump start on my online uh, caring for words course load I'm not quite sure but yeah, no, I'll do that. And, yeah. Uh, my parents are wanting me to call them. Hi, Mom. Hi, Dad. When you're watching this. And I'll see you in the next video. That will be probably weekly now. Instead of these first three days. Awesome.
awesome. All right, there's one more thing that uh, after calling my parents, I realized I should mention in this final Beans. video. <laughs> David's putting his bed together. Um, <laughs> no, we gotta, gotta cut that. <laughs> we're not cutting that. That that. The other thing he said that we did cut the video for. Uh, by the way, this is the second time I'm going. Uh, saying what I'm saying now is because the first time I said it, David said something inappropriate and doesn't want me to upload it to it YouTube. However, I am going to upload it and put it privately and maybe post it in 20 years. No. Okay. Uh, was that, now that I'm an extrovert, or I am an extrovert, keep telling yourself that and you might become one, but I go up to people and I shake their hand. Uh, ask what their name is, all polite. I forget it in 20 seconds and have to a uh, ask again next time I see them. But I, I've i realized now that it's hard to tell people they keep, they think my name is Zane or Zay or Z or Zaid but spelled Z-A-D-E. So the, uh, I don't know what the proper term is but what how I always go around now uh, depending on the group, if it's... Okay. The running joke around here now is when I introduce myself to people, if I'm with a group of people that I'm um, friends with, is I say, my name is Zaid, starting with a Z, and spelt Zaid. Thanks to Matt. Yeah, Matt. Uh, 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 one of our friends. A great sense of humor. He's, yeah, he's got a very blunt sense of humor. Uh, but other times, I say... Uh, my name is Zaid, as in like paid, but with a Z in front. Or if I'm with a whole bunch of guys and I'm trying to act cool like a player or something, uh, or act all cool, I say as in paid or laid uh, with a Z. But yeah, uh, they, and they made me say it to one girl, but she was a uh, junior, I think. So. Yeah. All right. I'll see you in next week's video. Uh, make sure to like and sub sub subscribe. Uh, turn on the bell for notifications. And I'll see you next time. <laughs>